G'day guys, um, I thought I'd uh, make a video, I was hoping to be doing this out in the field but um, under the current condition and rules we're not allowed out. What I was lucky to do was think a little bit ahead and I've managed to um, get quite a few buckets of material. Um, before we weren't allowed to go out and uh, do any prospect and I thought now this could last a little while you know they kept increasing the stages so I thought why not grab a ton of buckets and I had someone drop off a few buckets off their property for me to do some testing but uh, today I'm just going to be using some of the buckets that I grabbed all right so what I'm doing is trying out my screen that I've made that runs all the way up and there's a gap in between there in the bottom of the uh, hopper that uh, lets everything get through so got a little plastic tub at the bottom to catch hopefully a lot of the stuff um, my 2000 gallon pump um, just with my battery Now, one thing that I do is run some of this. This is um, it's a six dollar ninety doormat from Bunnings. Pretty much the same thing as Miner's Moss. And what I do with that is I put it up here. So that just slides in. It's a pretty tight fit, and it goes right to the edge of that clamp. And what it is, it's to increase your capture zone. And the other thing that comes in handy with is when you're running and you just want to have a quick check rather than pulling the mat out, just grab that, slide it out and have a look and see um, if there's anything in there. Also helps capturing some gems and things. So I'm going to uh, set the camera up and uh, start feeding this thing. And we'll see how we go. Should be able to hopefully see that this is uh, quite muddy, this material. Now the other thing, um, this is unclassified, this is pretty much dug straight out of the creek. So um, there's a mix of uh, different sizes of uh, rock and gravel and mud. So what I'm uh, doing is um, I'm just going to keep filling this hopper until it makes it all the way right down to the bottom to the point where it um, will almost start coming out the back.
All right, what that is is about um, half a bucket. So about 10 litres in the barrel. Now, as I said, this stuff is like clay, and we all know, once the uh, rocks start coming down here, we either have to bake them, like you should be able to see there, this stuff is solid mud, or some of it is anyway. Some of this stuff quite big. Now, even though I fed it fairly slowly just with the little scoop, I didn't rake anything away and I just kept filling and filling and filling. Just to show that even if I did dump all that material in at once, um, wasn't going to uh, start spilling out the back here. Alright, um, just let this stuff uh, clean this mud off. As I said, this is very um, yeah, this material's got a ton of clay in it. So I'll finish uh, this bucket off and uh, have a look and see if I've uh, got any gold in here. Back soon. All right, just to, uh, I know I'm probably going to get, oh, you're only putting little scoops in. That's not good enough. So what I've done is I've got a little bit uh, in the bucket, which is all the mud and crap was at the bottom. And I'll tip that out and uh, sort of more replicate what a shovel load or a couple of shovel loads would be like. So, you uh, should be able to see there that um, it's pretty overloaded, but, oh, wrong way. Still the water's not coming out the back, and that's what this thing's intended for. Um, I'm just trying to increase the amount of material that can be dumped in that hopper and that it can work with rather than having just that small little area down the bottom here. Now, I'm not saying it doesn't work the other way, it works. And I have found plenty of uh, gold with it that way. But I just wanted, I don't know, I wanted to change things up a little bit. I was considering using this little hopper um, and maybe getting a, um, a triple eight, which is like a short version of an eight inch with a mini cell mat. And the reason for that is I don't have the room in my car to um, put a big high banker in and I wanted a little high banker. And there's nothing on the market um, at this stage to um, suit my needs so 
obviously I'd run a lot more water but um, yeah, it's just something and I'm just trying to increase this hopper so possibly I could mount that hopper onto the triple eight obviously I can use these legs and all the rest of it and it doesn't make it all that much bigger all right I'll um, finish off this material just um, and then we'll have a look and see if we've got some gold all right uh, what I've done is just cleaned out um, the bit of miners moss that I had this stuff there's still some stuff in there um, all the little rocks and bits and pieces but hopefully all the goals come out so nothing exciting I'll do the mat and see uh, what's got past the moss all right guys um <laughs> had a lot of gold so there's two little bits there and there's another bit just there. Three little bits of gold got through to the mat. So most of the gold was caught um, in the uh, miners moss. Look, this wasn't so much about um, the gold today. This was more about um, this screen. And for me, the screen's working. Might not work for everyone, but for what I want to do, the way I want to run, I'm uh, quite happy with how the screen works. Look, I thought I'd just put something out there um, more than anything. Hopefully um, we're back out in the bush soon. And hopefully um, at some stage I will do some meetups. But at this stage, not even allowed out there. And um, meetups obviously... Um, are going to be a no-go zone so um, yeah it's a bit unfortunate but this is what happens when um, you know a virus like this uh, take hold um, and spreads through the community like it has look I hope you are all safe and your families are all safe and um, look until the uh, next time I'll uh, see you all later. Now, uh, I know I've become popular, but Tim Tam, what are you doing? Murray Rivers, salted caramel. Must be good. 0 0.5 health star rating. Must be pretty damn tasty. <laughs>